So this question says, in the xy plane, if 0, 0 is a solution to the system of inequalities above, which of the following relationships between A and B must be true? So I'm going to first and foremost draw out an xy plane. I suggest you do that anytime you see xy plane, and especially if a point is provided in the question. So I know that 0, 0 is a solution, and I know that I have these two inequalities. Um, what else do I know? I know that with the first inequal inequality, y is less than negative x plus a, which means I'm going to have a negative slope going through a as my y-intercept. So, um, and I'm going to shade beneath that line, so shade down because y is less than it. So if I want to shade down and capture 0, 0 as a solution, I'm, and I want to have a negative slope, I'm going to draw a, sl a line this way because that gives me the negative slope. I'm going to call this A, and I'm going to shade down. And by doing so, I capture that 0, 0 as a solution. My next inequality says that y is greater than x plus b. So in this case, I have a positive slope. I am shading up, so shade up. And b is my y-intercept. So again, if I'm going to shade up, and capture 0, 0 as a solution, and, I'm have, and I have a positive slope, then I want to have a line beneath 0, 0. Because that way I can shade above this line, and I capture 0, 0 as a solution. So I'm going to call that B. So I still don't know exactly what these values are, but I can compare them. So when I look at my answer choices, choice A says that A is greater than B. Well, that is definitely true, so I like that answer. B being greater than A, that would not work out. Um, A equaling negative B, just to skip C for a second. A equals negative B, um, maybe, but doesn't have to be, right? I, I could have put A way up here, and I still... Right, I still would have got the same solution. So A and B don't, do not have to be symmetric. So D is gone. And then I don't like C either because of the symmetric thing. Uh, A could be a lot lower than B. So C is not a good answer. You can try some different values there to test it out, but C is also not a good answer. This is why the best answer to this question is choice A. So again, the big picture here is... I understood this question because I drew a picture instead of trying to do it in my mind. I always suggest plug in picture, plug in a graph if the question describes a graph or something that can be drawn.